Okay, so uh, what a busy, crazy week. I will probably never for the rest of my life forget this week. Um, it's first week of being isolated, social distancing for the coronavirus. As of uh, last Friday, it was kind of mandated or something um, by not only my company, but by the state. And there's just a lot of things that are that were changing. Luckily, I was able to <clears throat> stay home with my my employer and and work from home, and my wife also as well. So that's that's still good that we don't have to miss on, out on any um, employment and paychecks. But it was chaos. <laughs> it was so, what a week! Because my kids also were. Um, <laughs> not going to school and yet they expect parents to also do the teaching and learning of the children it's such a hard thing I understand they're trying to make so school cannot be delayed so much but it is such a challenge trying to be a parent trying to be um, a stay-at-home uh, teacher you know teaching from home and and trying to do the best to help them do something during the day and also get my work done what a challenge and then um, we had an earthquake <laughs> one of the biggest earthquakes we've had in a long time and frankly the biggest earthquake that I can remember I remember probably I don't know it's probably been six or seven years ago there was an earthquake that kind of shook the house very briefly and that was kind of it but this earthquake was a 5.7 uh, happened uh, like 7 10 I remember being shaken awake standing up getting in the doorway I, I mean I was trying to decide should I go get my kids or should I stay it, it didn't last terribly long but um, immediately my alarm go goes off while I'm sitting there and it's shaking uh, so I think it was about 7 10 it's just absolutely crazy that day was just I mean weird we're already in isolation uh, because of the coronavirus um, and things were already kind of just schedules mixed up and then throw that in to the morning um, yeah just really crazy um, luckily no one um, in my family or anybody that I know got injured hopefully everybody was safe and no one got hurt uh, anything hopefully there was no serious damage for anybody and I feel bad for those that may have had that damage um, again weird week um, before the uh, earthquake we had a fun St. Patrick's Day that was probably the 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 really the biggest and funnest thing that my kids had this week I mean it, again it was so, so here I, I had some fun things that I did with my kids that I always do for St. Patrick's Day not a very big holiday but I always try to make it fun my mom did the same for me um, so we, we did some fun things. Okay, it is the uh, night before St. Patrick's Day. We're, we're building some uh, leprechaun traps. Can you tell us what you have here? Well, uh, this is my leprechaun trap. Yep, okay, <laughs> you got the bait, which is money. Yes. Right, and you wrote a message to the leprechaun, right? It's a good trap, okay. Well, twice, you. Lexi, good job. Yeah, this is a good trap too. See the money? For the bait is there, you know those leprechauns, they love the money. Really? Definitely. And then the leprechaun's gonna run, hit it, and get trapped under. That's good. Haley, how are you gonna, gonna set up your trap? You gonna do holes in it? No. Or do you wanna just set I'm going to, I think dad's idea is pretty good, so I'm going to do it if I can. Yep, yeah, we'll set it up. There's a good idea. Put, you put the pen there, there you, and then the leprechaun will see the money, and we'll try to jump in there, but then the pen will fall, and then it'll be closed oh, yeah. in. These are some good know, leprechaun traps. Leprechaun can't, can't go to each house. She, he could probably go to. He probably has a friend. Yeah. You never know. It could be. It could be. We'll see. I'm the leprechaun. We're gonna try. Okay. These are some good leprechaun traps. Then we'll go to bed and see we'll if those leprechauns I'm not, come. I'm not really using this. I'm just putting it in here. I'm trying to. It's hard. Okay. All right. <laughs> Let's see Bye, what we get. YouTube. Let's see what we get tomorrow. Bye, YouTube. A leprechaun. Mm -hmm. For them to get out to use their magic, mm -hmm. they have to give you candy. I think that's what it is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I think that I think that's what it is. Is uh, is you caught them, and then they had to get to get out. They had to get you candy. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Look how crazy this is. Look the 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 milk's white, but all of a sudden, as we poured it out, it turned all green. I told Haley, Josh, and Haley didn't listen to me. I don't know what happened, but we were just getting more milk for cereal for Zach and look the milk as I put took it out of the fridge just turned <laughs> green it's so crazy those leprechauns magic okay other than that fun st. Patrick's Day stuff just a weird week and looking like another crazy upcoming week with uh, isolation and I'm curious to see what schools are going to do um, I don't know. I'm sure we'll hear something this week as far as uh, what what schools will be doing. I imagine this um, isolation will continue and the schools remain closed. It's going to get really complicated um, with my own personal work situation. Um, yeah, I'm. It, 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 it's something that will again I will always remember because it's just such a crazy time. Uh, but I hope everyone stays safe. I hope that um, your families are good. And uh, we'll see you next time, YouTube.